Hi, I'm here with a Lenovo ThinkPad X13 Generation 2 i. Means it has Intel, the i. Um, and I'm going to use it, uh, make some videos of use case scenarios. There's been a few issues on the forum where uh, members have been trying to hook up all in one desktops as an external monitor to their laptops and they've had varying de de degrees of success with that and there always seems to be some problems so I figured I'd try it um, so I have the laptop here and what I have over here is an all-in-one A730 27 inch screen touch touch screen all-in-one desktop so I already tried to hook this up with this. It's a no-name generic display port replicator USB-C. I uh, tried to hook it into the Thunderbolt 4 port and uh, I didn't, it didn't work too good. I had the screen would flash on and off. Uh, I had it was jitter. Uh, I couldn't adjust the refresh rate because there was only one setting in a display settings. So I decided to run a USB cable from the all-in-one HDMI out port into the HDMI in port on the X13. So I did that. That's this port right here. So we'll see what happens here what I gotta do is come over here to the A730 and change the display to be an external display okay so it is now an external display for that let's go into the display settings and see what see what we're set for here all right, so the laptop display is number one. The all-in-one display is number two, which is the configuration where it's supposed to be. Uh, if I come down here, if I choose two, all right, uh, the display resolution is 1920 by 1080, which I figured it would be. Uh, have it set to extend these displays. Advanced display settings show it is set to 60 hertz. That's the highest setting there is. There's other lower settings, but I'm going to leave it at 60 hertz. See how that works. So this is a the display is an A730 FHD. So uh, let's get out of this, and we'll bring up a. YouTube movie. Now I can drag the display the screen back and forth which is what we're supposed to be able to do so I'm gonna open a YouTube movie and we'll see what we get. Let's just go to my channel. Alright. This is a canoe or kayak to be precise. And oh, it's let's pick something decent here. I was asked to find a fun car for not much money. And I failed completely. Okay. Doesn't look too bad. This is the Bowler Wildcat. Nice name. It's based on a Land Rover, but it has one key element that's missing from North All right, it Atlanta. seems to work. Speed. Let's see, can I drag it across here? We'll go from 0 to 60 miles an hour in 4.9 seconds. Yeah, I can drag it across. Next, we'll do it in 4.8. Looks really nice on that little screen. It does cost fifty grand. 
Okay. I think we have a success here. Everything's relative. This is the best off road. So that's how you hook an all in one monitor to a laptop. Uh, I'm sure a, a uh, proper dock would so probably work better and you could hook other peripherals into that dock. But for this test, I, I don't have a real dock. I have a bunch of little port replicators. I haven't tried with the USB, but I imagine a USB port replicator would even bring the resolution even lower. So, um, this is with the native HDMI, which I fully expected it to be that resolution and refresh rate. So, it's not working too bad. So, it's a doable thing. Thanks for watching.